Well, would you look at that? Grandma laid an egg. Wow. Well, it sure beats paying those store prices. What? Oh, I think someone's at the door. Who is it? Hmm. Well, whoever it was, they left their backpack. What? Let's take it inside. Hmm. Meanwhile, we also gotta separate these eggs. Mm, gesundheit. Oh, it looks like Mr. Backpack can help. Oh, a yolk separator. Yes. Try it out. Just crack an egg on top. Now it's time to get things running. Oh. Pour out those yolks. We're making meringues. Mmm, corn. Time to sink your teeth in. Oh, I didn't mean it like that. Well, it's okay. Make like a banana and peel that corn. I wonder what else it can peel. Give it a good squeeze. Oh no! Your glasses! And you can't see a thing without your glasses! When did that pigeon get in here? Oh wait, that's no bird, it's a gravy boat. But it's not just for gravy, add that lemon. We've got juice, now perk up that tea. Mmm, good to the last drop. Huh, maybe we should have started with donut holes. Or maybe we just need the right tool. Good thing we still got all this batter. Wow. Uh, uh, uh. Give it a push and the donuts just plop out. Flip them over once they're golden brown. They're ready. Once it cools, Take a bite. Of course, we can't forget about <laughs> topics, especially sprinkles. This carrot needs some tenderizing. Or better yet, mashing. Add some inside. And squeeze until it comes out like Play-Doh. Try this on all your favorite veggies. Wow. But the real fun comes next. Getting to eat. <laughs> Careful, stay inside the bowl. <laughs> the bowl. Okay, that whisk isn't cutting it. Or whisking it. Wow. Yay. This sauce stirs great for a hands-off experience. Just make sure to keep an eye on it. Nah. Now you've got a date with some sauce. Meanwhile, let's catch up on some knitting. It's time to grate some cheese. Careful. Little more. Huh, barely made a dent in those hot dogs. Oh my god. Don't worry. We can always try a little hand guard. Now you can grate anything you want. Granted, not everything needs to be grated. Gummy worms should be eaten al dente. Mmm, noodles. And we've got oodles. You know, it's even more fun to eat it. Uh -oh. What a tangled web she weaves. This looks like a job for our T-Rex chopsticks. It's a utensil that works on both ends. Great for those hard to reach bites. Huh, first Jack Horner in that pie, now this. If you're gonna stick your thumb in food, you're gonna need some help. 
It's slicing with a hands-on approach. And it'll let you tackle the whole produce aisle. Now everyone will want to peel potatoes. Who needs a green thumb when we've got orange? Aww. Just don't forget to eat the food when you're done. Wow, I never saw cookie dough leak before. It's not a hair dryer, it's a cookie press. Add whatever cookie cutter design you like. Just press. And pretty soon, we've got cookies. Look, it can be as easy as stamping. And I think we've got some left over, too. Ah, bread and butter. So simple, and yet so good. No wonder Madeline eats it every day. If only the butter could actually spread. Luckily, butter lipstick runs smooth. Well, that'll wet your whistle. But let's save some for the toast. Get into every nook and cranny. Nah. Now let's try some English muffins. Ooh, and a bagel. <laughs> Time to drain the pasta. Oh, whoops. Oh, uh, so Ew. who wants pizza? Come on. Oh, wait. Hey. Maybe this pasta strainer can help. Just add to the side and pour. The pasta's safe and sound. And I've got a great sauce recipe. Ooh, Grandma's mastered the whisk. Yeah. Just in time for her special cookie recipe. Of course, right now it's in more of a pancake stage. But that's nothing <laughs> our cookie stamp press can't fix. And look at all the different stamps. Now into the oven they go. Why not take a bite? Ah, cookies. So good, you can't stop at just one. Some food's mouth-watering. Onions aim for the eyes. Wow, that's pungent. Good thing she's in the shower. Apparently, it's okay. Rubber Ducky's got your back. A new pair of glasses is all you needed. Wow. They'll protect your eyes from watering. So get shopping. It is tea time. Oh, that's too hot. Let's try something cool. Take this silicone mold and fill it up with tea bags. Aww. Now, if we want to make ice, we're going to need some water. Wow. Gotta love any excuse to use a funnel. Now stick it in the freezer and give it time. Okay, that should be enough time. Let's take these tea spheres out for a spin. Yay! No, not like that. Add it to the water for a brand new twist on iced tea. This'll go great with some green tea ice cream. Grandma Marvelous stuff. Catch you next time. <laughs> <laughs>
Oh, looks like Grandma's got a visitor. Wow, that's a lot of food. Wait, did you see any German brothers and sisters on the way here? Hmm, maybe she's just a sweet old grandma. But seriously, either way, don't go near the oven. Time for Grandma vs. Gadget's showdowns. Stay tuned for the bonus episode, too. Separating the yolks from the whites. <laughs> Kinda makes you wish they were just sold separately. Oh. Looks like a cross between Birdo and Babe. But it sure does get the job done. It's almost clean off. Huh, I wouldn't think to pair eggs with something that looks wow. like a pig. Well, maybe with a side of bacon, or ham, or sausage. Nothing like a relaxing night watching a movie together. Uh-oh, they're out of popcorn. Don't worry, we've got you covered. Cue the next gadget. Just pour in the kernels and push the button. You can already hear everything popping. Just keep that cover on or the whole room's gonna get covered in popcorn. Oh, it's still spilling. Good idea. Add it to this giant bucket of... Oh, wait a minute. Eh, I guess you can never have too much popcorn. After all, you don't want to run out again. Mmm, potatoes. So delicious, but so hard to peel. Hmm, she had an idea. And I don't think it's just to make rice instead. It's a new gadget. You get a peeled potato and a really long potential french fry. But why stop at potatoes? Let's see what else this baby can peel. Remember, you peel it, you eat it. Aw, oh, some Ooh. fruit should be nice after all that junk food she gave me. <laughs> In other words, Granny's on a health kick. And we gotta be sneaky about our sweets. Let's just hope that this device can help us. Wow, it gives you a hollowed out banana. Still, let's not let all that good banana go to waste. But now for what we came for, using our banana's secret hiding place. Cue the Nutella. I've heard of chocolate covered bananas before, <laughs> but not banana covered chocolate. Come on, like you can really keep a secret from Granny? It's tea time. Some herbal tea can be a really good choice. Look at those leaves. Ew, a tea leaf. Oh, it looks like she's got something up her sleeves. A pink elephant? Oh, I see, it holds the leaves for you. So this way, all you get is just the nice smooth tea. And it comes in so many different flavors, from squirrel to manatee. Collect them all. Poor Nana. All those birthdays and no one's gotten her an electric mixer? Don't worry, you don't always need something electric to make things easier. Just watch, we can even mix the ingredients inside this giant bottle. Don't get any eggshells inside. And shake it. Shake it like a Polaroid picture. Really getting our money's worth out of these cookie cutters. Ooh. Mmm, there Grandma approved. 
Microwaves make cooking easier, but they're such a oh. pain to clean. Hey! Angry Mama? Are you sure? We might need Angry Grandma or even Great Grandma level. Don't let anyone know that's not her real hair or she'll get really angry. Don't yeah. let the mess intimidate you. She looks like a fighter. What? Did you think she'd just do the whole thing for you? She just made it a little easier. Time for cake. It's no one's birthday, but <laughs> Grandma knows you don't need an excuse for cake. Don't worry, they even have a gadget to help you serve cake. Seriously, there's something for everything. Look at how tightly it hugs the piece of cake. And don't forget the best part. You get to lick the device at the end. I knew I should have called dibs. Time for another snack. Ooh. Some fresh, healthy cherries. Oh. oh no, a lost tooth. I knew we should have stuck to cake and ice cream. Either way, we've come prepared. A handy dandy cherry pitter. Oh. Granny seems impressed. Guess she has to watch out for her dentures. B -b -b Bonus episode. Uh -huh. When you can't decide between a ball pit or a pool, why not both? What a cute little whatever it is. What's she gonna do with it? Ooh, it's like a tiny little doorknob. But something tells me it won't be tiny for long. Told ya. But what are we gonna do with it? Throwing them on the wall? Kind of reminds me of that carnival game. Except the balloons are the darts. Wait a minute. So that's how you make that toy from before. I was wondering how they were connected. And now you can make a whole team of them. Grand-sational stuff. Catch you next time. <laughs>